Take a look at this video out of Spalding County. This is from the January 12th tornado outbreak that moves through Georgia. This video from the sheriff's Facebook page showing the strength of the winds as the tornado crossed over State Road 16. A tractor trailer flipped over onto its side. It comes as people across North Georgia are still trying to get things back to normal. Tonight, Fox 5's Doug Evans reports on the efforts to help pets who remain lost and homeless from the storm. These two dogs, called Hominy and Grits, are examples of the many dogs found homeless after the January 12th tornado that hit the Griffin area. Spalding County Animal Care and Control is currently housing about 30 dogs at its old shelter. Some are now considered strays, while there are others here that the county is boarding because their homes were destroyed or the owners are in temporary housing. Um, and immediately started letting people know that there, there was a place for them that uh, their homes were destroyed, that they had a place that they could bring their animals that were safe, it was warm, it was dry, we had the food and the means to care for them. Spalding County is getting help from two groups, American Humane and the ASPCA. Both of these national organizations are on the ground and helping shelter workers care for these animals. Um, in a matter of 24 hours, we had somebody fly in and assess the situation, and then within 48 hours, they had a full team of uh, 15 people step in and, and start assessing the situation and, and helping us run the uh, shelter without just place pets and the stray animals in the uh, disaster area. Fortunately, Spalding County had recently just opened a new larger shelter, but we're told it was already full, so dogs from the storm are being housed at the old shelter. And there has been a tremendous outpouring of public support as well with donations, but they are still in need of more volunteers to help walk the dogs. We're told that in a couple of weeks, any of these dogs that go unclaimed or for whatever reason cannot be reunited with their families, that they'll come up here to Spalding County's new animal control shelter and they will be put up for adoption. And it's important to know that this is a no kill shelter. So these dogs stand a really good chance of finding a good family after all they've been through in the storm. I'm Doug Evans, Fox 5 News in Spalding County. Doug, thanks.